Hello Cup Coders, welcome back to the Cup Code Spotlight. Today we are looking at Overture. Um, I literally, I just saw this game in the Steam Marketplace and decided to give it a try. It looked interesting. I have not played it yet. Obviously you see it is the demo version. You know, if any game, anytime there's a game that's available and it provides a demo, it's always my policy, you know, I'll try out the demo before I decide whether or not I'm going to buy it. Now, unfortunately, not every game provides a demo. I wish they would, because that would be so much easier. I mean, you, you look at a few screenshots, you read the description, it doesn't say a whole lot about the game itself. You really have to play the game to find, excuse me, hiccups, to find out if you're going to like it. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to jump in here in the Overture demo and see if I like it. Uh, let's see. Warriors, rogues, mages, and shaman. It looks like we've got some interesting icons up here. I guess that's the exit. See, this is for music, it looks like. Maybe that's volume. I don't know. Tutorial on? Okay. So it's options. Interesting options. Control P to erase all. Wow. Nice, nice. I go back. All right. That's what we're going to do. Let's see, high scores, I guess. And I don't have a clue what that is. Statistics. Ah. The vault. Trade scrolls for gold. Okay, well, all right, well, I'll tell you what. Well, let's go ahead and get in on into this. We're going to go here to mages. I'm guessing this is credits. Yeah, that would be credits. So I'm going to go with mage because, you know, my name is mages. Mages 96. Mages is for mage, magician, magical. So let's play mage. Uh, no gold. Yeah, I have no gold. No gold. I can't upgrade. I have no, no gold. So play. How to run fast. One, stop attacking. Two, run towards mouse. Three, white trail appears. You're kidding, right? Okay. Like running fast is a very important mechanic for a boss. All right. So it's WASD to move left and right mouse to attack and C for stats. Okay, let's see what stats are. 411. Okay. Oh wow, we're picking up gold. Ow, 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 ow! Oh wow, okay, um... Yeah, did, seriously, I move, move real slow, move real slow. Hold on, get out of the way. Get out of the way, get over here. Alright, we're picking up some gold here. Ooh. Oh, ow, 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 where's my health bar? Oh, it's right above my head. Durr. Okay, wow. All right, well, first off, you move really, really slow in this game. Obviously. Is your tier one, level one for one? Look, man, I get far. Oh my God, let's do that again. Let's go with Warrior this time. Let's try Warrior. I have no gold. Really, no gold? I guess I have to collect gold per character. We'll see, we'll see. We'll, we'll die this one. Ooh, I haven't even started my timer. Oh my God, what am I thinking? Get in there. All right, so is that like... Fair enough. Hey, you can break stone, awesome. So it doesn't seem to be as many mages attack me this time. So that's a good thing. So we might be able to actually survive. Whoa, health potions. Oh my God, somebody hit me. Oh, the battle just continues. All right, we have giant things overhead here. Is that a boss? That looks like a boss. Uh-huh. It says that running is an important skill for bosses. But all I did was just literally just back away. Back away. Back away. Anything in this? NPC rescued. Okay, I got an NPC. I don't know what that means. Does that mean he's going to fight for me? Oh, it looks like he does. Hold on, hold up. Is he fighting for me? He's fighting for me. He's, he's got a hatchet. Or is that a meat cleaver? Ow, 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 ow. Ow, 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 ow. Trap sprung. Oh, my God. Too much graphics going on. Um, first off, first thing I'm going to remark is this, the, my, this warrior fighter that I'm playing right here. I actually recognize the graphics on this. It looks a lot similar to another, to like RPG Maker, I guess. 
So, I mean, but otherwise, I mean, it's not exact. It looks like they, you know, they might have taken, modeled it after it, and then made some changes to it. Ooh, a bunch of enemies over here. I'm actually surviving a little bit longer here. I don't know if that's good or bad. So it looks like they might have like redrawn it, but used that, used the, that as the original design type deal. I don't know. Oh, what's this? Yeah, yeah, ha ha. We got you. Oh, look at all the money. I just leveled up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, I got to lose track of my mouse here. Uh, I don't know what that is. Oh, okay. Are they call this a tutorial. Hold on. There you are. Get down here and get this wizard. He's just shooting at me there. I don't like things to shoot at me. I hate things shooting at me from a distance. You weakling, just running from a distance. Alright, can I, how do I, 20 attack? I don't know what I'm, what I'm using, hold on. Oh yeah, yeah, really? Kill you all, kill you all, let God switch out. Right, how do I use potions? Possible way to use potions? I don't know. I can't figure it out, man. Well, I, got, I got some money. It's in the demo. Alright, that looks like it's the edge of the world right there. And as as the world moves... Uh, take note real quick. As the world... As I'm moving the camera... See how these things are bouncing back and forth? That, that's... I don't know what, what causes that. That's obviously a graphical glitch. I don't think they intended for that. Die, mage! Die! Oh, we have a gold sword. We have a gold sword. Um, yeah, I'm taking that thing. 5% chance of dropping extra gold. There we go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What's, we, we want thing to go this way. So apparently that's where the boss is. I don't know, we're heading that way. I have a mage following me. Oh, it's the boss! Yes! Let's take out the little guys first. I died. All right. Well, I mean, that was pretty interesting. I, I don't know if it's something I play all the time, per se. But it is pretty cool. I kind of like it for, you know, if I'm just sitting around. I'd actually like to see something like that maybe on my phone. You know, I can see myself sitting, you know, waiting for the girls to get off the bus. Playing a little bit of this. That, that might be cool. Oh, I'll check no, no gold. I guess I, I guess you can't store gold in 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 the demo version. So that's that's not so bad. Um. Oh wow. Okay. So so you either choose your class here, or you choose it here. I think that instead of choosing that secondary screen where it's dark, it should probably bring you straight to here. I think that would probably be a better idea, instead of you know making you choose twice because this is just blah. But that is kind of cool. Like I said, all these graphics, it looks like RPG Maker graphics for the most part. But like they blew them up and re palletized them. I mean, by palette, you know, redrew them. You know, put same color but a different uh, hue of the color. Like they pretty much redrew it. I'm not, I'm not saying that that's what they did. I'm saying that's what it looks like. Oh, wait, there's more options. Okay. Get out from under me. I have a kitty cat messing around with me here. I think she wants out. Oh, check the mage. What, what other options? Witch, Invoker, Warlock. Okay, so there's other player types, subtypes in those. That's kind of cool. That might, you know, replayability. All right, well, that's going to be it for this episode. Um, if you like the game, you can go and buy it on Steam. I believe it was less than five bucks. I didn't really look at the price all that much, but I think it was about $3.99. It was on sale or something like that. So go check it out. Uh, the game is called Overture. Thank you for watching. As always, a like, a comment, and a share lets me know that you care. See you in the next episode.